I think it's the American dream and the pursuit of liberty and you know free freedom. So that's why we're together. So in the video, um, March, um, April 8th, we're having uh, when we had the Free Miles War rally. You were all there. So I want to ask each of you, why do you want to come to a Free Miles War rally? I'll start with you, Kara. Uh, I wanted to come to a Free Miles War rally because I learned so much about Miles Go through your organization, and I am the founder of Citizens Against Political Persecution, and I believe that Miles Guo is politically persecuted in America, and the people that are persecuting him are people that are persecuting a lot of people that I care about. I stand up for anybody that's a political prisoner like Miles Guo. Mm -hmm. Wow. And John? Well, look, there are a lot of parallels to uh, what our government tried to do to us here in America during the lockdowns and what goes on every day, as many of your followers know, uh, in China, the CCP wants to take advantage of the people. They want to take away their identity. They want to tell them what to do, who to worship, what to read. But um, one thing we have in common, I know we all have this in common, is um, Amer we all know America is the greatest place on earth. And the last thing people like us want is for the CCP to get their tentacles more into America. And what we do need in America is to keep our combined spirit going and the collective thought to make sure we do everything we can to protect our country from being any more like that. Because that's not what any of us are here for. Yes, and Ronald Reagan also said, freedom is a fragile thing and it's never more than one generation for an East extinction. So, Kevin, you were giving a very passionate speech at the Free Mouse War rally. What inspired you? Well, simply uh, put, it's first and foremost an honor. My upbringing is 53 years old, and I know Miles is 53, so it was neat to find out they're very similar in age. Just the diversity that he, the challenges he's had to come through from China to successfully move from where he was to where he is now in a cell Mm -hmm. Ironically, I was a correction officer for 21 years. I actually saw the men and women behind cells. My mother was actually an inmate in the same prison that I retired from. Not then, but after, you know, years later. The, the reality is I don't like bullies. I don't like bullies. And the CCP and the DOJ in this government system are bullies. And they're trying to take every one of us down and unfortunately Miles well, Miles is an example of what they're trying to, if they can destroy Miles, they think they'll destroy us, and that's why we have to fight for him. Absolutely, we have to fight like hell.